As you can see, I've got a bar now on my shoulder. The tide is coming to say hello. If I took, put, put, put my head here, he'll come tickle my... He'll come chew my beard. Now, down here is just the chickens. They're not very odd animals. You guys have, have all seen chickens. This is Chicken Under King. Which is... He is awesome. There's also KFC, Nando's. This one over here is Nando's. Lighting is not the best right now. These chickens were actually battery chickens that were um, raised from day old chicks. But I actually came in here to show you my number one bird. His name's Tyler. Hello. That's not Tyler, that's Auli. So Tyler is... There's Tyler! Hello Tyler! Now Tyler... Tyler is largely like a cat in a bird's body. He loves his head tickled. Oh yeah, oh yeah, there he go. Oh yeah. And you can tell you found the right spot because his eyes closed and he sort of just starts drifting off. Now Tyler, he was raised in captivity as from a chick, so he believes he's a person, he's a rescue, however as a chick he obviously broke his wing in his nest, and the SPCA when they found him, they didn't know this, so they carried on raising him, no one corrected his broken wing. Yes, Chicken Under King, yes, hello. So Chicken Under King likes to keep, have his say. So they raised him without realizing his wing was broken. So his, he's grown up with a wonky wing. His wing is skew. Uh, to add to this, he probably wasn't fed properly when he was a chick. And he had too little calcium in his diet, which make, makes his bones more brittle, means his bones can't heal properly. And that's that's compounded the problem but he is the most friendly bird we have here he just loves being loved and he's like a giant pussycat if you start tickling his head he makes a little squeaking sound which is his version of purring and his eyes closed and he just falls asleep he is such a friendly animal he also has this lovely habit of coming to the door to greet me he also likes to climb to my shoulder our other owl here, Ali, who's not as friendly as Tyler. Now, Ali, his bones were very brittle when he came in because he was, wasn't being fed properly by the previous rescuers and he had a calcium deficiency. So, yes, yes, chicken out of king. And his bones were weak so his legs kept him breaking so a lot of these birds have had sad stories but they're happy now they... oh, Ali's, Ali's a bit grumpy he's friendly when it's fe when it's feeding time but he, he likes to sleep during the day which can't blame him so this, I'm just gonna leave him alone Tyler's the one that loves attention now if you look down here at his claws those are his weapons uh, as with most raptors and birds of prey everybody always thinks like an eagle's beak is its weapon no, it's the claws, the talons now you, when you look at Tyler you can see his his um, mangled wing his deformed wing but it doesn't actually affect his life that much he's quite a happy bird as you can gather it just means he can't hunt for himself and he can't fly very well. He does still fly, he just flew across the cage right now. You gonna come clean my beard or clean my hair? Hey? Clean my hair. Yeah. Now right now his his friend Ali, his cage mate, is behind him. And Ali is a bit more temperamental and doesn't like being cuddled and loved and doesn't like preening me. So I just hope Ali doesn't come and try and nip me. Hey? Hey, yes, yes, 
Oh, you're gonna clean my hair. Hey, clean my beard. Clean my beard. Clean my beard. Like straight out of Harry Potter. You are gorgeous. You clean my beard? Or you spotted chickens? Huh? Seen the chickens now? Yeah, they have the chickens. See, there's some perches in here. Got some live plants. It's relatively a nice sized enclosure. Each got each owl's got a box, nice branch here. So Tyler is a carnivore, as you guys have probably gathered. So they eat, in the wild they eat rats and mice mainly. But in captivity we try and we try and feed them mainly chicken. Uh, rats and mice are a bit rich for captivity, especially if the bird's sitting in an enclosure and it's not flying for its food. In the wild, birds have to hunt. They're actively flying around and they burn off a lot of the fat. So rats and mice are a treat that we give them sometimes. But in general, these guys eat raw chicken. And it's not raw chicken that, that, that you guys get from the shop usually. It's the it's gross chicken. We chop, chop up whole chicken that still has its, its feathers on and everything. That way the birds have to clean their food, which which gives them mental stimulation. It's good for their it's for their brains. It's and it's environmental enrichment. Hey, his claws are starting to get to me. He's starting to sink them into my shoulder a bit. Come on, can you go into the branch now? Okay, sorry about that. Oh yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Bye-bye, Tyler.